Hi betting experts, on Monday the 19th of July, first of all look back at our two bets at Redcar on Sunday, and we move on to air on Monday, fast ground expected, the weather forecast still set fair, we start off with our value angle selection in the 135, this is the Air Gold Cup sponsor revealed today, handicap a 6 furlong class 5 sprint for 3 year olds and upwards £3,132 on offer to the winner, I think there's one who's definitely overpriced here, Michael Smith's bottom weight filly earn your stripes now she's run four times in total only made the frame once but she shaped with promise on a couple of occasions at Hamilton on the 3rd of June when beaten just three lengths by cooperation, sent off 250 to 1 there and then second behind Verox Evil who's quite useful in the north Beaten four and three quarter lengths at uh, Carlisle, but shaping really well in a clear second, particularly considering she missed the break, raced wide throughout. I thought that was quite promising. So she started off in handicaps at this track, but over five furlongs behind Rory in a class six, sent off. Uh, 40 to 1 there, uh, racing up the centre of the track and just fading at the furlong pole. That was a much better uh, race than this one. She's open to a bit more improvement. I think the step up to six furlongs will definitely suit her. And a mark of 60, well, on her two placed efforts, I think that's quite generous. And most of these are completely exposed and more to the point, really struggling for form. The favourite, Stronse, is a pretty reliable stick, it has to be said. Um, But he's a five-year-old. He's run 35 times and only won twice. So, obviously, while he sets the standard, it's not going to be a great race. He wins. And earn your stripes with a little bit more to come after just four career starts six furlongs fast ground expected to suit i think she is well overpriced at around 14 or 16 to 1 this morning for our nap of the day we go to the opening one o'clock this is the long jeans irish champions weekend ebf restricted maiden philly stakes seven furlongs class four two-year-olds only four thousand eight hundred and sixty pounds on offer to the win it's cut up there's only five runners it looks to concern three of them um namely turn back time who made a promising start for mark johnson but i think that yard is genuinely struggling now their strike rates about eight percent in the last couple of weeks lots of them disappointing so i'm overlooking that one phil de la lune who finished second first time out in a pretty ordinary race at carl burke i think she's the danger my selection chelsea annie who's got a bit of experience has run twice and i think sets a clear standard on form i like the fact that she ran really well at this course over six furlongs last time and finishing second behind the very well backed bin annie finishing like an absolute train and really shaping as those seven furlongs will definitely suit her i think she's the clear form choice i think she'll improve for the longer trip and she's the one to side with best of luck on monday betting experts